what's up guys welcome to another video so in today's video we're planning on going to um, the Yota Rondebosch pair they're having an open day there and uh, two clubs are going to be there as well I think it's Bad Apples, 2CZ, G Nation, uh, Chap Motion and there's another one the Yota owners but um, uh, let's go get the car pulled out of the driveway and then head on over there I think the car is clean from the last ride I don't know uh, it's been parked since we had the uh, that N1 pulls and broke that um, of this video cable. Let's get her ready. My me bro. It plays with the fucking wheel is flat. Yar, look here. You can see this thing is fucking pop. My bro, spur me something with the score. And I was outside, I didn't even notice that the wheel was pop. I came up to open up the bonnet. And check it out. We have to remove the speedo cable. That broke. And now I didn't see this thing is fucking. The wheel is now so pop. Yeah. Yeah, guys, so on off camera, I was trying to take the wheel off. I got these three loose. But this one is stripped inside. Look here. Now I can't get this fire wheel off. Yo, my bro. This is I don't know now if I must just drive it so to the garage. I don't just want to mess up the wheel, CJ. I think it's. Nah, it's already 11 o'clock at the news now. I'm gonna make it to that roundabout thing anymore. Anyway. I think I'm going to take a slow cruise to play with it. Uh, so a friend of mine is in the pull up now. He has a uh, uh, those 12 volt uh, air compressors, so we're gonna just pump up some air in there. Hopefully it holds, so that we can at least pull through better on the bush. But the tail today, the open day. Give me a Yeah, comes my help. We wait, we wait, we wait. It's gonna look like it's holding any pressure though, but I don't know. Okay, we're getting somewhere, we're getting somewhere. Just have to give it a bit of help for the check. Get some weight off the wheel. But, getting a bit harder. Inside, 
Yo peeps, so we back. Okay, so we back home. Uh, yo, I think today was like a very eventful day. 
went to go two car shows. One was the uh, Theater on the Bosch um, open day, and then we have the let's put this off. Then we have the German works one we were also at today. Both of them were super lit and eventful. I know, like, yo, I get so excited now, and I saw like. <laughs> my cup just got off recording because I want to enjoy what's happening in front of me also and like yeah the river also I wasn't planning on the river off but yo I don't know I like to say you plant the screwy and then I just said I'm gonna get my car and when I saw that I think it was the E30 the 2 to E30 multi-valve when I also got some launch control I was like nah this is gonna be like a river against him so I decided to go and also with that also kind of testing the cooling issue that we had um, seeing that it survived that and it was actually like a warm yesterday. It was nice. It was a wonderful day. Um, so that it withstood all the raving in the heat. I'm sure our cooling problem is solved that we did in the last, in the previous video. I think maybe it was just air in the system. But yeah, uh, we had all the water pump out, so we know that's not an issue. So I don't know. But yesterday proved that we've solved that issue, hopefully. But yeah, I want to show you guys. I got the steering wheel in the previous video. I said I'm going to get the steering wheel, and I did. I just want to show you guys. Okay, so it's all boxed in here. Let's just pop this thing open quickly. This is a OMP that I got. And no, it's not the original. I don't have that kind of money for original steering wheels. So I got the rip. I'm a good buddy of mine, actually. A work colleague. He's selling his 20 valve. And he bought this a few years ago, but he's never had a chance to fit it. So he... Whoops. So he hit me up. Knowing that I'm looking for a steering wheel, just get this up. So, this is the wheel I got. I know there's many of them around, but this is what I was looking for. Just actually, I wanted the red one since my brake calipers are red, but blue and yellow goes well as well. So, um, yeah, this is the steering wheel. I'm so excited to put this thing, it's gonna really change the whole look of the car. Here's the router. OMP Uta. Whew, it's gonna look neat. Let's pop that in there. And that's what it's gonna look like, more or less. It's gonna be so clean. But the other thing. I don't think I wanna go straight. It's crazy. Oh, it's the Uta terminal. But yeah, that's the steering wheel that we got. What do you guys think about it? I'm gonna go and put it in the car quickly and I'll show you once it's all in. This is a definite, definite game changer for the cockpit. Oh! Definitely giving that JDM feel now. Now it's definitely giving that JDM that race feel. What do you guys think about this new steering wheel that I got? Definitely changes it up, eh? This is a, a huge addition to this vehicle. Because that other steering wheel pff, ruined the whole interior. But yeah, I've come to the end of my video. Uh, if you guys like this video, if you enjoyed me going to car shows and uh, participating in the levels and stuff give it a comment down below so i can you know look into things that you guys also enjoy um but yeah hopefully soon to hit the track i don't know how soon but that's the next aim so you guys are getting some more time in the call um i don't have any seat time in the call in terms of racing though but um yeah that's for videos to come so yeah, i'm trying to work on my algorithm so you guys um liking my videos and stuff especially in the, the previous video i don't think i've gotten so much likes in like such a short period of time smash the like button all of you guys please it's doing wonders for this channel um and hit the subscribe button if you guys really want to see more content uh for definitely of the 20 valve and as well as the TDI. i haven't posted much of the TDI in a while uh, i've been focusing on the 20 valve because this is like my race slash you know shit box but my daily but yeah, till next time, peace.